Hello guys, it's Johnny Time and welcome to another DeFi tutorial. Today we'll learn everything about Zap liquidity, the new feature in PancakeSwap and this kind of feature also exists in other DeFi protocols and finally today you will understand what the, this kind of term Zap liquidity means. What is this feature? Why is it so special? Why it's good for DeFi? How it works and what are the risks with Zap liquidity so all these kind of things we're gonna discuss in this tutorial and learn so i hope you're excited as i am and without further ado let's get started All right, so if you are in DeFi for a while, you know that adding liquidity sometimes can be a pain in the ass. Why? Because always when you add liquidity, you need to add 50% of each asset, of each token. And why is that? It's because the way that liquidity and AMMs work is that there is a smart contract that is always trying to preserve a balance between token one to token two that's why when you add liquidity you need to supply the exact same amount of token one and token two and people sometimes don't understand it in DeFi, and they don't understand why in order to make passive income on bnb or on busd they need to buy half of another asset and then add the liquidity exactly together and this kind of requirement it makes DeFi more advanced and more I would say difficult for people, especially for newcomers that want to come and explore PancakeSwap or SushiSwap or Uniswap. As you can see over here, now if I want to add liquidity, I want to add one BNB and now I need to buy also USDC or if I want to add liquidity with ADA, now I need to buy six ADA and it makes it all thing very complicated because this is the way the AMM works and the smart contracts work. Now here comes Zap in our favor to simplify the whole liquidity provisioning and providing liquidity the whole process will be simplified thanks to this kind of zap feature how exactly by the zap feature automatically the smart contract let's say you want to add for example bnb with cake liquidity so i'm going to click here liquidity and at this wallet i don't have any cake i have only bnb so in the past if i want to add liquidity before this app feature i would need to go to trade to swap and then swap my some of my bnb tokens to cake to the exact 50 percent amount let's say i want to provide 0.02 bnb now i need to think how much is it in cake buy cake tokens then i need to uh, supply the liquidity but now thanks to the zap feature i can just try 0.04 bnb and i don't have cake so what does the pancake swap does for me what kind of feature it is it says no cake input some of your bnb will be converted to cake so it's automatically gonna save me trouble and convert 50% of my BNB because I didn't supply any cake it's gonna sell the BNB and buy cake and then add the liquidity and here it shows you the rest the ratio the ratio you have 70 cake per BNB and 0.014 BNB per cake this is the current price price ratio in the liquidity pool in the smart contract of the liquidity of BNB and cake and this is our show of the pool so if you are here in uh, banks up for a while you're already familiar with these kind of terms if not make sure to watch my other videos about pancake swap subscribe to the channel for all this kind of awesome educational content and that's basically that's what zap the main feature of zap it's simplifying the liquidity and let's just do it as an example so here you can see that i have only bnb i don't have any cake i will click here supply and it shows some kind of summary this is the new feature of the zap it shows that 0.02 bnb gonna be sold for 1.4 cake and then the pool will be 0.0199 bnb with 1.4 cake so this is the transaction that's what it's going to do two actions sell bnb for cake and then add in liquidity bnb with cake quite simple quite nice so this is the main thing about zap also it also helps you remove the liquidity so if you want to remove the liquidity you can choose to remove the liquidity let's say you have hundred dollars of bnb and cake you can remove it to only cake or to only bnb the exact same thing but reversed 
So this is the whole thing. This is the buzzword Zap. Now you're more familiar with it. It's more gas efficient. You don't need to do two transactions. It's all going to be in one transaction. And it's quite cool uh, feature that will probably help people to land into DeFi and crypto. The problem with this feature is that sometimes people are not aware of the fact that 50% of the tokens are going to be sold for the other tokens. So in my opinion, this kind of alert message needs to be a bit more like I don't know, reddish or big or bolded because people might not know that by clicking here, 50% of their BNB is going to be converted to cake. So this, in my opinion, one of the um, risk of Zap liquidity is the lack of knowledge of people. That's why it's good to watch these kind of videos and understand how the things works behind the scene. Now, if you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comments below. We'll be more than happy to help. And if you have any ideas for cool videos, interesting videos, things that you want to learn, also share with me in the comments below and make sure to like the video. It really helps to the algorithm to push this knowledge to more people and subscribe for more videos in the future. Thank you so much and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.